I recently saw this picture of a hoodie and thought about what those encrypted variables mean. So, why not decode this puzzle today? I have written the expressions right here, and there are four in total. All right, so what could we do with this? Well, let's try basic techniques, starting with multiplying the expressions. Maybe we will get some new expression that is useful, but as it turns out, the second expression is actually an equation, so we can't really multiply them. Now, let's rearrange the expressions and think more clearly. So for our four expressions which I am writing, we have tried to multiply them, so why not add them this time? Writing out the sketch of the equation, but we run into the same problem. Only equations can be added together. And also, we can't find the value of both x and y here. Let's now go back to the expressions. There are three expressions we could make graphs of, but two of them are in terms of x. So let's substitute y in those two expressions using the equation. If we find the value of x in terms of y, we can input the value into the expressions and make a graph. Now that we have the value of x, we can input it into the expressions. Here are our substituted expressions. Although, when I made the graphs, there was not really anything interesting, which just gave me an idea. We could plot the value of all the expressions in this equation to obtain graphs, writing all four as functions instead, like so. Plotting the first function, we get a hyperbola, like so. Now let's plot the second function, taking the second expression, and it turns out to be a circle, thankfully. Now for the third, it is a normal V-shaped type graph. And now plotting the fourth and last one, it is a spring type shape. Now let's plot all four graphs side by side, the hyperbola, circle and V, plus the spring shape. Looking at the second and third graphs, they look like English alphabets. So I deduce that the other two graphs must also be in English. And by looking at the advertisement again, we can point out that besides all the text being in English, the person wearing the hoodie is also American. So let's decipher the first and fourth graph. And since I don't want to use gradient type optimization just yet, we will examine the graphs once more. Now putting the hyperbola back, it kind of looks like an L and one upside down L. So I think there is a good chance this is supposed to be an L. Although I am a bit disappointed in the makers of this hoodie. Bringing back the fourth graph now, and now it becomes easier to decipher this poorly made expression. The first three letters are L, O, V, and V. And I think you can guess the fourth one is E. Love, something you might not have experienced. And let's make it a heart too, because I feel bad for your broken one. And if you hated the hoodie, but liked the video, be sure to love the subscribe button and don't buy this hoodie.